Hi, my name is Debbie Talach and I'm an artist and photographer here at Ranger. Today I want to show you a project using ultra-thick embossing enamel. We here call it UD for short. We're going to start with ultra-thick embossing enamel in clear. Pour the UD in and what we're going to do is just to use a tiny bit of the white. All of our UD is very highly pigmented, so all you need is a little bit. So we're going to take the white and just pour a little bit on the top and we'll put our cover on and let it melt. When your UD is fully melted, just take your cool tool spatula and gently stir the UD. We don't want to form any air bubbles. And when it's all mixed, what we're going to do is use memory frames in two by two in polished chrome and we're going to put it right on our craft sheet. If you haven't um, poured from the melting pot before, I would suggest that you try it a couple of times first. It's very easy. And what we're going to do is pour directly into the center of the frame. And it's going to go outwards towards the corners and just stop. Once the UD has cooled, just pull off the little UD strings and we're ready to emboss. We're going to use the Essentials Emboss It clear pad. And we're just going to open it and apply it directly to the rubber stamp, inking it up nicely. Take our stamp. and give it a nice emboss. And we're going to get some little scrap paper and put it underneath. We're going to be using the UD Brights in two colors, in blue iris and green zinnia. And we're just going to pinch it with our fingers and apply it loosely in stripes. Then I'll use the green zinnia and apply that also. You could, if you want to, between these steps, put them back into their respective jars, or you could do like I do and just keep a jar for all of your leftovers and it becomes a rainbow jar. What you might want to do is wipe off the edges so you have a clean area where the frame is. Or, if you like that, you could leave it right on there and you can emboss right over the metal of the memory frames. And what I'm going to do right now is turn on our heated craft tool and emboss. Once your UD is cooled, you can add a ribbon and you can use it as a necklace, an ornament, embellishment on a card, or a scrapbook page. I hope you enjoyed the project and just remember, have fun.